Hello Pixel Pushers, this is Sadiq here, a new uh, tutorial on the iPad this time, Affinity Photo on the iPad. Now this time we're going to choose a new document uh, to actually get an image onto, not an existing image but one from the um, Pixel, uh, Pixel Bay uh, stock photography. So I've created a new document here using the dimensions that you saw earlier. You can pause that part of the screen and just doing pinch and zoom with the fingers on the iPad to get the document. So on Pixabay, uh, which is one of the three stock photography sites built into uh, Affinity Photo on the iPad and the desktop, I've just typed in a, a subject towers, but of course it could be anything, brought in an image of uh, London Bridge and um, just going to resize that. So pinch to zoom out and then resize the image itself to fit onto the document onto the canvas. Now for now, um, it doesn't really matter that I've squashed that picture. Um, it's just so that I can fit it on there. And then I'm opening up the studios on the right hand side and I'm going to pick the one that is used to create a border, which is the um, on the right hand side uh, outline. Um, and then at the bottom, you've got the uh, tool sensitive studio sensitive controls and the key thing there is to have it as white color because that shows off the uh, picture and also the size of it and make sure it's either center or inner uh, alignment which i've just changed there it's i've set it to center and i've changed the size of the border to about 74 pixels uh, but of course that's entirely up to you what you decide to do and that's it. Once you um, uh, close the image, uh, go on to the top left arrow, go to the home, it's saved and all done. It's as simple as that. Give that a go and um, we'll see you next time.